All right, we're filming. All right. All right, so basically me and Alex just had a really good day at the thrift, at the outlet. So we're both going to uh, show off some of our stuff. Pretty the top 10-ish. Yes, a little showdown. showdown. I think he beat me, though, because he was there before me, so it's not even fair. Yeah, yeah, that's true. I was there before. But do you want to go first? No, you got it, really. All right. So I'm going to show these off first, just because I'm interested, because I haven't sold any jeans before yet a lot. Um, but these are some Tommy Hilfiger um, pants. Um, they're a size 30 waist, um, oh, nice. but they're in great condition. Uh, yeah, too. They, and are. they sell for about 45. Pretty well, that's, a, that's a pretty good find that I found. Today. Yeah, I need to. I haven't really checked out jeans like that. Um, all right, the first thing I'll show is uh, Dale and Hart Senior, I guess. Sure. He's bringing out the heat already. Yes, sir. I got to start off flexing. Dang. It's, uh, it's an older shirt. I don't know the exact date on this beast. But uh, has an older tag, and but the screen printing on this is ridiculously good. Mm -hmm. There's a little bit of cracking on the back, but the front is in it perfect looks like, condition. Yeah, it's in perfect. So yeah, I found that. I'm hoping to get like 35 out of it because it's all over print, but we'll see. Damn. This just this Vila shirt is pretty sick, and it's got the print up like on here on the sleeve. On the sleeve. Yeah, yeah cool. super sick. Um, and it's like it looks like it's new yeah just it's, about the tags. yeah it literally looks brand new um but uh so i'm gonna try and get 25 for this for sure at least nice nice all right i'm gonna keep it going with the graphic tees i guess this is a, a hard rock cafe new orleans shirt and so the front's pretty standard but the back is super sick in my opinion it has like lightning oh, yeah. bolts and shit and like a bunch of guitars it says uh, Hard Rock Cafe World Tour. It's one of the cooler Hard Rock Cafe shirts I've found. I found a Honolulu Hawaii one, which is really cool too. But this is definitely the second coolest one I've yeah. found. There's some cool Hard Rock Cafe shirts yeah. out there. Um, yeah. I picked up this Santa Cruz shirt. Oh, nice. Which is like, there's a little bit of cracking up on here. Oh, nothing but too it's, bad. But it's nothing too bad at all. Um, and the back is like in perfect condition. So I That's think this nice. is maybe like a, hopefully another twenty dollar shirt that yeah, I can sell for sure. Oh yeah, and for my Hard Rock Cafe shirt, I'm gonna try to get twenty five for it, twenty five or thirty for it, just because it's older and the screen print is in good condition. The next item I have is actually pretty unique. I found a bunch of women's Tennessee stuff, and this is a really old Tennessee starter jersey, and um, it's pretty plain. It's yeah, got the embroidered nice. Tennessee logo, the Tennessee where the name should be. And then in the embroidered star, uh, starter logo. So, I yeah, don't know. It's a pretty unique jersey. Yeah, I haven't seen many like that's this. That's super sick. You found, like, a bunch of stuff. Bunch yeah. Of I found, like, a whole pink tracksuit, like, four t-shirts, and then this jersey. Someone put the four t-shirts and this jersey all together in a bundle and asked, like, 45 for it. Yeah. Um, And then I think I'm selling the pink Tennessee starter or jumpsuit as, like, separately. Yeah. Um, And then I just picked up. This is a pretty cool it's a coca-cola nascar shirt. oh i love that shirt yeah that shirt, may be my favorite thing you picked up yeah this is super sick um it's got just a bunch of i guess just numbers so it's super sick maybe hopefully 35 yeah, I hopefully, think hopefully 35. yeah it depends on if it's like a really high yeah. event or not we yeah. don't really know about nascar we just see that uh, like the really stylized ones go yeah. for a lot i'll keep it going with the nascar i found another one this is a NASCAR Sprint All-Star Race Cup Series. Um, so on May 16, 2009. So it's not that old, but it has the speed thing on the background. Um, and I actually picked up a couple of those shirts today too. So I had never found a racing shirt since we started going to the outlet, since it opened by us. And I found, we found like eight today. Yeah, we found which a is lot. Crazy. And at, like we went, cause we usually go at right, open, open or, or at close. Yep. And we, I went at 2.30, and there were so many items. Then you came at yep. maybe, like, 3. three? Yeah, yeah, a little and after 3. And all that NASCAR yeah, stuff. Yeah, usually there's not shit I at 3, seen, but there uh -uh. was so much stuff. Yeah. It was crazy. There was a bunch. But, yeah, here, here's the NASCAR shirt, I guess, I, I found. Uh, just a Dale Earnhardt. Um, it's the uh, the Chase Authentics. Um, these, are, these shirts go really well um, and go for a pretty... Oh yeah, and the sleeve I think is worth noting out isn't like yeah. cut off. It's designed to be a yeah. cut off. So it's like somebody took scissors to like a nice shirt. And yeah, did that. 
Yeah, so that is a super cool. I one. think that's really sick. But thirty thirty five for this yeah. one too. Oh, I was gonna say I'm hoping to get uh twenty to twenty five for my uh the NASCAR shirt I just showed, just because it's a little bit newer. Um, but it is a really cool graphic, so I may start it out higher. Um, all right, this is the last racing shirt I got. It's a uh, I don't even know if it's a NASCAR shirt. I think it is. Racing shirt. Yeah, that is. Sick. Um, but it just has a really cool graphic, and it's like, uh, where is that? New Hampshire, maybe? Wait, is that London? No, Lou. New I don't... Hampshire, I think. Yeah, yeah, I think it's New Hampshire. Uh, the graphic's not in perfect condition, but it's in pretty good condition. And it's, all, like, the all-over graphic. Like, yeah. it takes up most of the shirt, which that I like. Those shirts do so, so well. I don't know. Maybe start it at, like, 25, but I'll take, like, 15 for where it... Yeah. And this, I guess, windbreaker. It's got the embroidered uh, Nike symbol right here. It's an XL, and also what I think is super cool that I haven't seen on any Nike jackets, it's got Nike oh, right I here. I didn't even notice that. Right here, which is super Dang. cool. Yeah, so it's, it's definitely from the 90s, for sure. Just like Ooh, looking yeah. in there, definitely vintage. So hopefully 35, maybe hopefully 40. You maybe will get like 50 out of that. Yeah, thing, honestly. honestly. Yeah. yeah. I could yeah. I could really make a lot off of this. For sure. All right. Um... I have, this one isn't as cool. It's it's newer and it's already cracking. So I'm just hoping to get a quick $10 out of this, but it's a uh, BB-8 shirt. It's actually like a cool ass color and design. Yeah, that's a really I wish there was no design. screen cracking, but you still have the sizing tag intact, the officially licensed. This is just gonna be a quick $10 t-shirt flip I do. And that's about $4 shipping. So it's an easy like four or five bucks I get for every $10 shirt I sell. And ten dollars shirts, they're so great. You can literally make back your money that you paid. Paid for, for the it. Items, yep, exactly. Which is so sick. Yep. Um, I found this really cool, like, this. like vintage Texas A and M. I guess was super vintage pullover, dude. just jacket. Yeah, it's yeah. super vintage. It's like a windbreaker. Yeah, and like I don't even know what the brand is. It says it's an XL, but I don't yeah, it's a weird. It's an interesting brand. I'm not sure either. I don't even NG. But, uh, yeah, hopefully maybe 50, 45 on this. That looks like it could be from the 90s. Yeah, I might search up some more about this yeah. and see how much it could actually be. I would do a Duke embroidered jacket. It has the Duke Blue Devil logo up here and yes. the Duke logo on the back, dude, which is Flames. It's a genuine stuff brand, so it's like a not very well-known brand, but it has kind of that North Face premium look to it. Unfortunately, it is a kid, so I'm looking to just get a quick 20 bucks out of that. Yeah. 15, 20 bucks out of that. Dude, jackets are awesome, though. Yeah, I've, they are. I've sold, I mean, I only sold one, but still better than mine. And then I just have this Seahawks Super Bowl 2014 uh, crew neck. And it's really cool. It's got the Seahawks logo on the sleeve. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, it's really cool. It's, it's, I mean, it's only from 2014, but it just seems it looks older. Old, yeah. You know? I don't it really know. does look older. Yeah, hopefully 20, 25. Yeah, I think it's This thing I've seen, the Old Navy Vintage. I'm not sure if it's exactly vintage. The tag oh, makes it look like early 2000s kind of vibe. And then I really like this design. It's a skiing shirt. I think it's a really cool shirt, and it's a stylized shirt, and it's a shirt that you don't see a lot. So I'm actually going to list this pretty high at like 42 bucks and see if I can... Get anybody to bite on that. Yeah, for sure. Oh, we got some more heat, dude. Yeah, dude. This uh, Clemson Tigers, it's on Champion uh, Crew time. Neck. Um, in perfect condition. Oh, I always try and check and double check yeah, same. for holes and stuff. I mean, I just got to get a lint roller and get all the dog bear off. But, exactly. Uh, That's flames. Yeah. And the purple color is cool. Yeah, I really like it. So hopefully maybe 35 for that. I think definitely champion. Yeah. yeah not good mm -hmm. condition. Oh, the Notre Dame. The Notre Dame. This is absolute this is, heat. I think yeah. it's a de really decent amount of money. Oh, yeah, this. maybe like 65, yeah. hopefully. It's a bigger size. I think it's an XL. Oh, it's a double X. Stop. Bigger sizes can go from yeah. the Yeah. Oh, not yeah. Common. It's champion, too, so... Yeah, hopefully I can get a lot more. That's a really yes. good condition, honestly. Yeah, yeah. it is. Uh, let's see. And then oh, this I is this, the dude. honestly my favorite item I got today. Yeah. For real. So I think it's my favorite item you got. Yeah. Seen. Just it's so clean, dude. It's Michael Jordan when he was on the Wizards for a couple of years. Oh. oh 
It's heat, dude. It's, it's absolute I'm, heat. We got yeah. today. I got 13 pounds of stuff. I don't even know. You had to get close to 30 I, pounds. I, I got 42 pounds. Jeez. On, um, that one. And then I got, I think, only 32 on the other one. <laughs> It was a lot of clothes. Dang. Bro. I just found a lot of shit. That's so crazy. I'm going to be listing them, like, just, like, right now, I am. Yeah, we're both going to go and list right now. So yeah. uh, we'll get a couple clips of that, and then, yeah.